Welcome to Melanated Magic TV, and I'm your host, Jessica X. And today, I am coming to you with a story out of WTKR.com. Mother arrested for allegedly mason group in fight with her daughter. Newport News, Virginia. A mother was arrested on Tuesday for allegedly macing a group of people that were fighting her daughter. Around 7.15 p.m., officials were informed of a fight in progress in the Belly Lee and Woodside Drive area. When officers arrived, they found a group of females being disorderly and several of them experiencing the symptoms of being sprayed with mace. Officers separated the parties and identified the mother of one of the juveniles who stated there was a dispute with another juvenile. Officers also spoke with the mother of the other juvenile who was identified as 34-year-old Keisha Rankins. While Rankins and the mother of the other juvenile were talking, their daughters began to fight in the middle of the street. The other juvenile mother tried to separate the two and then became a part of the fight, resulting in several other people joining in. It was reported that Rankins located a can of mace on the ground and started spraying to get everyone off of her daughter. After further investigation, Officers arrested Rankins for three counts of malicious assault by acid explosive fire, two counts of assault, and three counts of contributing to the delinquency of a minor. First thing first, I have to say this. How and why is Keisha locked up? She was only doing what police officers do. She sprayed mace to disperse a crowd that was attacking her child. She did nothing more than protect her child. And if anything, the mother, (coughs) excuse me, of the other child should be happy that Keisha did not do more than just spray mace because she could have opened fire on her to protect her child. But instead, she decided to do what the law do, what officers do, spray mace to disperse a crowd. And another question. Well, not even a question. I'm just going to say this. And another thing. She went to the other parent to have a conversation about her daughter and the other parent's daughter, child. And in the meantime of her trying to have an intelligent conversation with someone who apparently wasn't intelligent enough to have a conversation and instead, you know, a fight broke out and instead of the parent breaking up the fight, she thought she decided that it was wise for her to jump in the fight. I understand protecting your kids, but when it's two kids fighting and the parent is here to talk to you about your child, you need to listen and maybe try to get some type of reconciliation. But instead, when the two kids started to fight instead of her breaking it up like real parents supposed to do. She decided to jump a child. My question is, why is it the other parent locked up? Why is it the CPS not involved with this other parent? Because apparently this other parent cannot supervise kids and cannot take care of kids. And she was abusive to a child. She jumped on this lady's daughter. She's lucky, you know, she's very lucky that Keisha isn't like me. You want to know why? Because some parents are warriors when it comes to their kids. And me personally, 
I would do whatever it takes to protect my kids. I would lay down my life and die for my kids. I will go to war for my kids. Whatever it whatever it takes to protect my kids, best believe I will do that. And if someone happened to harm my kids, best believe I believe in an eye for an eye. And I'm not using that lightly. But in situations like this, when a parent is coming into you to talk to you about your child bothering their child and you decide to jump in instead of stopping the fight, that shows the mentality of you and what your child has learned. Your children are image and replication of you. Whatever you are, your kids are going to be. Your kids learn from you. So, with that being said, you you see how the other parent act. What real parent would jump into a fight of kids and just start swinging and knocking and bucking on kids? Really? I would have done the same thing. I would have maced the hell out of everybody. And I probably would have went ham and probably would have swung on people. I'd probably be locked up myself. I'm going to say, you know what? Keisha needs to be free. This does not make any sense why this mother is locked up for protecting her young. That's what she's supposed to do. She's supposed to take her, protect her child. She is doing only what a mother is supposed to do. And if she did anything less, I would say she's not a mother. free Keisha. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And again, I am your host, Jessica X.